Hey guys, it's Brayden. And welcome back to another DFF OO video. And in today's video, we got the release of the Infrared Ultimate Trial on the global edition of the game on top of um, a new banner featuring Setzer's EX and um, also with Onion Knight and Lena in that banner and many more from the latest update, which I'm going to be talking about in this video. So first of all, we got the newest Ultimate Trial for Ramu, which you're seeing on the screen. And it is... Um, he is a little bit more difficult than Infrit because he has, as you're seeing, those crystal things from his lightning bolt attack. I forgot what it's called. But, um, yeah, he's he has a little bit more health as Infrit as well. But he's not as annoying as Shiva was because she was pretty annoying to farm because, yeah, obvious reasons. But that's about it for Infrit, I'd say. Uh, why do I keep saying Infrit? I meant to say Ramu. Uh, but, yeah, that's about it for his... Uh, ultimate trial which will be pretty good um i hope you guys enjoy your farming um which will be as boring as it always is but yeah we got you guys can get those um summon board prizes stuff which is pretty nice so let's go to the um new banner as well also wait i forgot to mention one thing there's also the super synergy for sets or onion knight and oh wait no wait yeah super synergy for um Onion Knight, Setzer, and Lena on top of, um, um, Maria's, Maria, Sid, and Ikyo, Ikyo? I think that's how they say it. But yeah, they're super synergy for the newest Infrit event as well. Now let's actually get to the new banners. So the first one we'll be featuring is the newest Setzer's banner, which is featuring Setzer's EX on top of, um, Onion Knight and Lena, and I actually like this banner because it actually doesn't have half bad characters, and they're um, uh, that don't that aren't featuring the X. The, the characters aren't actually that half bad, so um, that's nice. And uh, yeah, I also built up Lena and Onion Knight. In fact, Onion Knight was my first um, EX that I ever got, so that's pretty cool. I don't usually I don't use Onion Knight that often anymore, but he's not that bad. He's not as bad as he used to be in early stages of the game. Lena is still very good, but she um, is getting her... Um, she does, It's not featuring her EX, so we will not be... Um, so she's not as good. She's not chaos viable at all without her EX, but with her EX, she's still pretty good. So uh, you guys can take Lena into chaos if you already have her EX. But yeah. There's also an event draw that's right next to the Setzer Onion Knight Lena um, banner that is featuring Sid, Maria, and Ecos um, that don't have an EX. So this banner is pretty trash. I wouldn't suggest pulling for it at all. There's not much to say about it, so let's get to the next thing. I just checked, and there is actually no more updates that happened, so... I'm gonna, I guess we gotta cut straight to the shitty polls, which I usually do at the end of the video, so I guess this, one's, this video is gonna be a pretty short video. So, shitty poll for them. Uh, Setzer, he is, he is very good as a support character. People still use him even in JP, so he's very good as a support role and, um, be, um, for, it's, it's kind of complicated, but he's, if you use all of his abilities in a support, he is really good um, with his Freeze Joker, his... Uh, I forgot what all of them are called, um, all of his abilities, but they're all very, very good. The only problem that Setzer has is he doesn't have very many abilities, so he is... He is that's the only thing that doesn't make him very good, so it's, it's really just... And on top of, we also have really good people coming up in November that you guys should save your gems for. I think I'm only going to use tickets for this. If not, I'm probably not going to pull it all because I know Setzer is going to be coming back with, um, uh, what's her name? Wait a second. Setzer is going to be, Setzer's EX is going to be coming back with, uh, Sarah's EX as well, which I don't have. So I think I'm going to wait till, um, that comes out so I can get Sarah's EX. If she's even good by then, I don't really know how good she is at that time, but I think that's probably when I'm going to end up getting Setzer's EX. Um, he's not, he's not as chaos viable just because he doesn't have very many abilities, but he's still very, very good. Um, so... Also, Lena, like I already talked about, she's pretty good. Um, Onion Knight, he's okay. Like I said, I used him a lot. 
He's not um, he's not that good anymore, but he's still okay. He has um, he has stuff that a lot of other characters do. He does do a AOE ice attack, which is kind of useful after he uses it once, but it's 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 not that good. But there is an advantage to getting stats for right now though, because he does he is gonna be very good because he is super synergy right now with B and if you use him in your party while you're um summon boarding everyone up, he's gonna be super helpful in um getting you those extra points to make summon boards a lot faster. And um yeah, and, but that's that's one of the main things. Um but I don't really care about that too much because I'm still going to get the summon, summon boards done either way. So it's it's not really that much of a problem for me. So I think I'm going to wait for Cesar and pass. I might put a few tickets into him, but if I don't get him, that's fine. Um, but I wouldn't see just putting your gems into him because there is some very, very good banners coming in coming up in November that are going to be very good for chaos which I would suggest saving for so that's about it for this video um there's not much else to talk about there wasn't very much stuff in this new update but there was some there was small there wasn't very much stuff but there was a lot of good stuff in it so if you guys enjoyed this video make sure to leave a like if you guys enjoyed that'll be it for me and I'll see you guys next time bye guys